I'd like to make a few comments about the probation report to start, specifically the defendant's uh, statement in the probation report. He says he regrets not being able to ride his beach cruiser. Well, Stan Smart had to pick up Kristen's bike from Cal Poly. All the while, Kristen's family will never see her again. He admits he has an alcohol problem, which at least corroborates what happened in this case. And yet he still maintains his innocence and blames law enforcement and everyone else for being here. But we know he lies. We know he told investigator Bill Hanley that he has no problem with white lies, no problems with fibs. And any future parole board should know this defendant has proven over and over again he has no problem lying to achieve what he wants. And the bottom line, even from the statement, from 27 years, he has zero insight into his crime. Zero remorse. Zero empathy for the family of the young lady that he snuffed off the face of this earth. And if and when he is ever in front of a future parole board, he will fib and lie to them too. So I'm going to object here. This is not sentencing. This is not a message to the parole board. This is should be sentencing, should be addressed to the court with regard to the appropriate sentence, of which there is only one. But I object to uh, messages to a future parole board. That's not appropriate. All right. And your objection is noted for the record, Mr. Sanger, and Mr. Cobell, you may All of which shows that Paul Flores is a true psychopath in every meaning of the word. He is a proven and admitted liar over the course of decades who takes perverse pleasure in raping women while they are completely incapacitated. He murdered Kristen with zero remorse or concern. And the world now knows the truth that Paul Flores is a sick murderer, rapist, and psychopath who should never be released from prison. You know, this morning in Monterey, Salinas, we had an atmospheric river and it was raining pretty hard on our way into court. But walking in at 1 o'clock for today, the sun was shining. And I looked up, and I just felt and I knew that Kristen is smiling down upon us, saying, hey, everyone, justice is done. <coughs> May Kristen rest in peace. And ask this court to sentence Paul Flores to 25 years to life.